Hey guys, Michael from Copper vs Glass, and in today's video we are checking out the top 5 iPhone 15 Pro cases. We have got a ton of cases to look at in today's video, a lot of which I've also reviewed on the channel. So again, I'll be linking those individual videos down in the description below. We've also got a ton of different price points from very budget options all the way up to the more premium side of things. We've got five top cases to look at, plus a ton of others. So let's take a look. Now, just a heads up guys, we're not gonna be looking at any official Apple cases in this particular video. They are a little bit overpriced and there's tons of other options as you can see on this table here as well. You've also got tons of different materials. You've got silicone cases, TPU cases, fabric cases, vegan leather cases, aramid fiber cases, official leather cases. You've got a ton of other options available compared to what Apple offer in the Apple Store directly. Now, full transparency guys, while I have tested and used each and every one of these cases in this video, I actually use my iPhone 15 Pro completely caseless. However, I know a ton of you guys like to accessorize and customize your device using a case. So let's take a look. So coming in at number five and around $49, we have the Moft Movis case. Now this here is an amazing case. If you're looking for that leather look and feel that you used to go with Apple's official leather case, however, this one comes in at a fraction of the price, but it still feels extremely premium. Now, Movis is a revolutionary self-developed vegan leather by Moft directly, and it features a balanced combination of softness, durability, and sustainability that is non-toxic and of course, environmentally friendly. And that's one of the main reasons why Apple actually got rid of their official leather case. Taking a quick look around the case, you've got your camera housing, and yes, it's not necessarily the most protective, but it still looks and feels extremely nice. All of your buttons are gonna be extremely tactile and very clicky, so your volume up, down, action button, and of course, the power button. Now, they're not metal buttons like you used to get on the Apple leather case, but they still feel extremely premium. You've got all of the cutouts on the bottom of the case as well in regards to your speaker and USB type C ports, and it is also big enough to accommodate a ton of different cables as well. And just in general, guys, this case looks and feels extremely nice. They've done a very, very good job with the leather effect on the actual case here and also works with a ton of moft accessories. So you've got the phone lanyard, power bank, the snap on wallet, and of course the tripod stand, which I have featured in a previous video. This, along with everything else that I feature in today's video, of course, will be linked in the description down below. But this is one of the best leather options. Next up then, and coming in at a very reasonable $29, we have the solid suitcase from Rhino Shield. And this is the case for all of you guys out there that continuously drop your device. It exceeds military standard, drop resistant, and survives an 11 feet or 3.5 meter drop. Now that's a really high drop, and most of you aren't really gonna be that high using your device, but it's good to know that it's gonna be protected with its Eco Shock Spread technology. Now it's available in a ton of different color options, or of course, like a lot of Rhino Shield products, you can actually customize your own. For me though, I love this neon orange colorway that they've got going here. You've got your camera housing, which is a very nice over fit and finish to it and again it provides a ton of protection you can see the magsafe ring depending on the color of case that you've got however it still looks really really nice all the buttons again are going to be very tactile very clicky like i've mentioned beforehand and they are also customizable so if you want to take them out and switch them out for white buttons black buttons purple pink whatever you want to do you've also got the option to do so but they still all feel very nice even though they are very modular now again the bottom of the device you've got a massive cutout here for the usb type c so again a accommodating even the biggest of cables and of course you've got full access to all of these speakers down the bottom as well and in general this is probably one of the more protective cases that we're going to be looking at in today's video and for very good reason like i mentioned it's got that shock absorbent technology called eco and that does a really good job when you are dropping the device even from a very high vantage point then it's going to be protected even at that 11 foot mark like i mentioned earlier on in the video so if you're one of those kind of people that unfortunately drops your phone more often than not, then the solid suit by Rhino Shield is definitely up there when it comes to the rugged overall protection for your iPhone 15 Pro. And let's face it, if you're gonna be dropping your phone, you wanna do it in style. Coming in then at number three, we have the Peak Design Everyday Case for the iPhone 15 Pro, coming in at $49.95. It's available in five different colorways. We've got charcoal, midnight, sage, sun, and redwood, and it's just a very unique case with this fabric design. 
Now the case that I've got is actually the V1 version of this case, but they do have a V2 version. And the main difference with that being is the V2 version does have the action button there. Whereas on the V1, whether it was an early prototype, they didn't know what the phone was gonna be like, for example, it unfortunately just has a cutout where the action button would normally be. However, it's still very easy to get to. You've also got a very nice camera housing around the camera here as well. And it's very, very protective. And it just feels, again, very nice with this overall fabric design to it. You've got some very minimal peak design branding and the buttons are some of the clickiest buttons that I've ever used. Again the volume up and down and also the power button are very tactile but again you do have a cutout for the action button but again it's big enough where it's not necessarily a problem. The case itself is also extremely thin coming around at about 2.4 millimeters. You've got a rubberized full frontal shock absorbing bumper and of course that nice fabric design on the back that I've mentioned before. It also has the slim link technology which is specific to peak design and it basically allows you to use all of their other accessories. So if you do want to use a car mount for example or attach it to your bike then you've got a load of different mounting options much like you have with GoPro but for the mobile phone side of things and the iPhone 15 with this particular case. Now the one downside to this case is how deep the entry is at the bottom for the USB-C speaker array so it does mean that unfortunately some USB-C cables aren't going to work with this particular case but overall I think with the titanium finish this is a really really nice combination again coming in at around $49. Just missing out on the top spot we have our number number two case and that is the mag easy 5 from pataka now this is on the more premium side of things coming in just shy of 70 dollars but in my opinion it's definitely worth it the case feels extremely nice it's got very premium materials and also has some of the best and strongest magsafe magnets i've ever used in a case so it's going to work perfectly fine with all of your magsafe accessories it's also available in two different colorways with moonrise and sunset now with this case it does make the camera array on the iPhone 15 Pro even larger than it already is but it just means that it's going to be more recessed and way more protective. You've also got this nice aramid fiber material which gives a really nice overall texture to the case itself. Now with it being such a minimal and slim case you don't have any sort of full protection so all of your buttons are going to be cut out. So again your volume buttons, action button, power button are going to be completely cut out so again they feel just like you're using the actual buttons kind of because you are. You've also got a full cutout along the top and also along the bottom side of things for the USB-C and also the speaker array. And what this basically means is you can use it with any accessory that you need to. It also works with some USB style docks, which some of the other cases don't work with. So again, it looks really good, but it doesn't necessarily offer that all around protection like some of the other cases that we featured in today's video. I think though for the overall value that you're paying for, yes, it's on the more premium side of things, but it actually feels well worth the money compared to some other cases that are around $40 that maybe feel like 20 this definitely feels like more upper end when it comes to the overall finish fit and also just in general the production of this particular case and again those magsafe magnets on this case are the strongest that i've ever tried so then we have the number one case for the iPhone 15 Pro and coming in at $39.99, it is going to be the Banks Armor Pro case. The Armor Pro case is made with real Kevlar fiber with a grip of 600D. Now what that basically means is it's gonna be extremely good for those higher drops at around five feet and it just feels incredible in the hand. The Kevlar that you've got around the back is very finely woven so that it just feels very soft while offering overall protection. It kind of feels a little bit like a silicone case but just a little bit stiffer and it just feels really nice overall again you do have the metal ring around the camera housing as well which provides a ton of protection if you're going to be dropping this thing onto concrete or any sort of hard surfaces then it's definitely going to make a dent with this metal ring that goes all around the camera housing with some very minimal banks branding on there as well all of the buttons around the case are going to be extremely clicky as well volume up and down power button action button and you also have a really nice accent color on the action button here as well it would have been cool if the whole button was orange but it still looks very nice and just gives a little bit of extra flair to the case itself you've also got full metal buttons as well and just in general they feel incredible you've also got a really nice lay on the table design while being very slim it still offers that protection if you're going to be dropping your phone face side down you've got an ample cutout as well at the bottom for the usb type c and the speaker array so again using a variety of different usb c cables you've got no problems at all and just in general guys this case feels really nice in the hand while it feels very soft it still offers a ton of grip to it as well and it also is extremely slim so it doesn't really add too much bulk or too much extra size to the overall form factor of the iphone 15 pro and again coming in at just under 40 dollars it's also a very affordable option for the materials you're getting the premium build quality and just in general the overall protection that you're going to be getting for your thousand plus dollar phone 
They also do an Armour Air version which is a little bit slimmer while still offering that full protection. And that's going to do it guys for my video on the best cases for the iPhone 15 Pro. Now everything will be linked in the description down below. And again, I do want to know what cases you guys are going to be using as well. So whether it's a very protective case, slim case, leather case, whatever it may be, be sure to let me know in the comment section down below as well. So that maybe in the future I can check out some other cases and maybe even make a part two to this video. If you guys aren't already subscribed, now is a great time to do so. And of course, once you've hit that subscribe button, don't forget to turn on the notifications so you're notified any anytime I post a video here on the channel. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass, thanks very much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next video.